It's a new beginning for an old church. We are pumped. <laughs> The Wentworth Baptist Church was born in the 1890s, and the congregation has worshipped in this building for more than 90 years. But it was put up for sale due to the high cost of much-needed renovations, and the pastor was planning to take his flock elsewhere. That is, until Indwell came along. Probably the back end of the property will be taken down. It's not in the best of shape, and then we'll be rebuilding on there. Graham Cubitt is from Indwell Christian Charity, which purchased this site just days ago for its next affordable housing project. This newer side of the building will be turned into about 40 one and two bedroom units, while the older half with the sanctuary will be restored. Our church has a real heart for the people who live here and um, we love serving here and we're excited to just be able to continue to do that. Construction will begin next year with occupancy expected by 2024. I think it's a great idea, you know, for people that are having problems finding places to live because it's very expensive now. I hopefully everybody is very neighborly like the rest of this particular neighborhood is. We're very community. You know, people uh, are uh, friendly and no, no real trouble gets caused. The apartments will be rented for a price that's affordable on a limited or fixed income, something that Inwell says is increasingly in demand in this red-hot real estate market. Gentrification is a reality in Hamilton. Uh, areas that have been long not invested in are being reinvested in for lots of positive reasons. There is a kind of speculation that's happening as well, and that is impacting people negatively. Nearby, Indwell is working on another affordable housing project at the old Royal Oak Dairy. When completed, it's going to offer 139 units, one bedrooms, two bedrooms, and three bedrooms. The first two phases getting completed early 2022. Crews are converting this former dairy stable into 13 apartments that will be ready by the end of the year. And work is continuing on the rest of the complex, including a five-story building with 52 apartment units and a three-story building with 43 units and a parking garage. Matt Ingram, CHCH News, Hamilton.